to uh, ABC7 meteorologist Ryan Miller. He's live in Front Royal, Virginia with a look at mm -hmm. uh, what things look like out there. Hi again, Ryan. Allison, it is uh, very snowy out here. We have held on to the cold air in the Shenandoah Valley for the duration of the day, and we're in the 20s, 26 degrees. I just checked the thermometer close to where we're standing at the moment, and you can hear what's falling from the sky. And folks, that's an indication. If you can hear it, it's sleet. And we do have some ice pellets that are hitting, and uh, the sleet continues, although it's slowing down. We do not have the heavy amounts of precipitation that we were seeing just an hour ago, and that's good because some dry air is working into the Shenandoah Valley uh, at least uh, for the near term because later on this evening more moisture will get wrapped around the storm center and head our way. Folks are out. There's a few folks out here. We've got lots of snow that's covering all of the roads and really it's not necessarily advisable to travel anywhere around Front Royal or the Shenandoah Valley right now because of those road conditions but we did manage to find a few folks that were out and about even in shorts. I'm originally from West Virginia, so I miss it. And it's, it's good to have snow again. It is. I grew up in Ohio, and I feel the yeah. same way. It's just yeah. nice to have it back. You're in shorts. Uh, well, I am from West Virginia, so you got to... <laughs> Folks out enjoying that was Todd and his family, some Chinese food here, and then they said they were heading back home to uh, build a fire and just hang out for the rest of the evening. And we're hanging out here as well. There is very little going on. A lot of the businesses have actually wrapped up and sent their employees home for safety reasons. For the perspective of how much snow has fallen, right now I have one of the surfaces we found that has not been touched, uh, indicating about six and a half inches of snow. Uh, but generally speaking, I bet there was probably closer to seven before the sleet started to cut down and push down uh, the snow that has fallen throughout the day today. We're going to keep an eye on things here in Front Royal and in the Shenandoah Valley and let you know here if anything changes coming up just a little while from now. Carl, back over to you. Yeah, I know there is a lesson in here for